Okay, Sounds of Decay 2 is Serpent Corpse. The album is called Blood Sabbath. Exciting debut from this four-piece out of Montreal. Serpent Corpse formed back in 2020, and after a very squealy and raw 2021 demo, they have returned with Blood Sabbath, a very heavy, riffy affair in the vein of obituary and early Celtic Frost. It's kind of strange. Metal Archives lists only two active members in the band, but don't believe it. We confirm with the band that the original four members are still very much a part of the project. Adam Brialt and Chris LaCroix on guitar, Andrew Haddad on bass and vocals, and Zachary Stu on drums. The band is definitely progressing. Song lengths a little longer than the demo. Three over the five minute mark, but the album itself clocks in at a very 1993 friendly 38 minutes overall. Most of the tempos are of the slower, dirgier speed, typically kicking into thrashy segments here and there for a minute or two. Crucifixion Shine is a good study in the Serpent Corpse sound. Haddad grunting and gurgling like a seasoned pro as the band dashes through three minutes of classic style OSDM. Seems like guitar solos are reserved for the longer cuts like the six minute Land of Rot and Misfortune. This is all we're gonna play for. This you. is maybe the strongest cut on the record with some very early Slayer esque changes and effervescent leads from LaCroix. See what I did there? Effervescent. Uh, and Embryo. Oh, yeah, definitely. Embryo. Death metal fans, there is a new force to go with your Grenadiers and VHS. All hail the Serpent Corpse. Okay, so this is Land of Rot and Misfortune. This is the Snaggletooth Extreme Metal Podcast. (laughs) 